Hi guys, so I wanted to just point something out to you which I think is really lovely to notice at this time of year is especially for students who've worked with me on my winter tree ID courses where we look at buds a lot and bud scales, tree buds and where I am in the north of Scotland the, a lot of the trees now are bursting their buds and you can see the bud scales that have for instance here of the rowan that have just burst open and I've got a cheeky chattery blackbird in the background and um, and if you have a look with some of the bud scales as we talked about there can be vegetative buds just for the leaves there can be floral buds just for the flowers and some buds they, they pack in that tiny bud the flower and the leaves as in with the rowan so here we have and not just one flat one leaf here we have three leaves that were they're compound leaves so it looks like there's lots of little there's lots of little leaflets on one leaf here and then we've also got the flower of the rowan all packed in that tiny bud it's just quite magical to look at the other thing that uh, Mark Galloway from Wild Foods thank you for uh, your vlog around Wild Foods and also posting about the floral buds of rowan and I've never tried them before and I tried them the other day and they're really delicious they do taste a little bit like almond and um, if you look at the floral blood of the rowan, it's a good reminder, especially with lockdown at the moment and people who can't get out, is in your kitchen you have unopened floral buds. It's, if you're eating broccoli or cauliflower, basically it's a little bit like the rowan, the unopened buds of the rowan flower here. 